Long ago, in the lush village of Ekondo, there lived a kind woman named Ngali. She was known for her delicious palm nut soup and her warm smile. Ngali had twin daughters, Ngani and Titi, who were as different as day and night. Ngane was blessed with beauty that made flowers jealous. Her skin glowed like the morning sun, and her hair flowed like a gentle river. Titi, however, carried a heavy burden. Her skin was covered in painful, itchy sores that no medicine could cure. Despite their differences, the sisters loved each other deeply. Ngone would often sit with Titi, telling her stories to distract her from the pain. One day, Ngone would say, we'll find a cure and you'll dance in the village square without fear. The villagers, though, were not so kind. They whispered cruel words when Titi passed by, holding their noses and turning away. Some even called her walking misery. This broke Ngali's heart, but she never lost hope. One day, as Nungoni was collecting herbs in the forest for her sister, she met a handsome stranger named Mbella. He was lost, looking for the chief's compound. Ngoni, her heart fluttering, pointed him in the right direction. Mbella couldn't forget Ngoni's kindness and beauty. He returned to the forest, hoping to see her again. This time, he brought his twin brother, Ngando. When they found Ngoni, she was with Titi, who hid her face in shame. But Mbella and Ngando were different. They didn't run or hide. Instead, they sat with the sisters, laughing at Titi's clever jokes and marveling at her strength. For the first time in years, Titi felt seen as a person, not a problem. Ngando, touched by Titi's spirit, said, My uncle is a great healer. May he try to help you? Titi, who had lost faith in cures, hesitated. But seeing the hope in her mother's and sister's eyes, she agreed. The brothers returned with their uncle, Baba Ekima. The wise healer examined Titi and mixed special herbs. Use these, he instructed, and have faith. Days passed, then weeks. Slowly, Titi's skin began to heal. The sores faded, the itching stopped, and her beautiful smile shone brighter than ever. The village watched in amazement as Titi transformed. As Titi healed outside, the village healed inside. People who once shunned her now asked for forgiveness. Ngali's old friends returned, ashamed of their past behavior. Mbella and Ngando, who had seen the sisters' true beauty from the start, asked for their hands in marriage. The celebration that followed was the grandest Ikondo had ever seen. Titi, radiant in her health and happiness, danced in the village square, her dream finally coming true. As the sun set on the joyous day, Ngali looked at her daughters and their new family, her heart full of gratitude. From that day on, the story of Ngoni and Titi was told throughout the land, reminding everyone that true beauty lies within and that kindness can change lives in ways we never expect. And that's it for today on 3 Minutes Folktale with Pick Stories. Remember to like, share and subscribe to the channel for more fresh stories. See you tomorrow.